Again, with the latest on the Gilgo Beach murders, News Comptor 7 over Massapequa Park, where right now investigators are digging up a backyard looking for clues. It is behind the home of suspected serial killer Rex Uherman. Yesterday, authorities brought in a backhoe to start digging. Eyewitness News reporter Shantae Lands is live in Massapequa Park with more. Shantae? Australian and David, I can tell you right now, today makes day 11 of investigators searching that home. What they're looking for is still unknown for sure, but they are continuing to dig literally and figuratively. I want to take you straight to some video of Copter 7 we just showed you overhead showing that backhoe. There's also what's called a radar, use radar equipment that's used to search for additional evidence. It actually works for digging. It looks for voids in the ground, which shows that it was disturbed possibly from digging. Now, last week, Gilgo Homicide Task Force pulled hundreds of guns out of this home along with furniture and electronics. We've also learned that investigators have moved through the home to the basement but still need to search the attic and garage. Neighbors, meanwhile, are speaking out now that there's a backhoe in Rex Hewerman's backyard. In the beginning, it was a shotgun. Now, it's like, oh, my God. You know, the victims, their families, uh, the suspect's family, um, living so close by, it's, um, you, you never thought of it. With all this that's going on now and the helicopters, I guess you could say, you know, it's definitely becoming like more real. You realize the depth that, of the investigation. And that neighbor says investigators have actually been knocking on his door along with many other neighbors doors spanning blocks from this home. We also know that investigators will remain on scene here for at least the next several days, possibly wrapping up by the end of this week.